Hello, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Good evening. Disculpe, Blanca. Hola. Solo Dios. puede quitar el número que tiene ahí de Jimmy y coloque eso en inglés corporativo, porfa. Ok, gracias. Uh -huh. Ahorita. Eso sería el rename, ¿verdad? Ahí está. Ok, muy bien. Gracias. Good morning, good morning, good evening, I'm sorry. Estamos un poquito aquí. Complicada la situación, sorry. Give me one second, one second, please. I know this one. Okay. Welcome. Ya estamos con la cuenta correcta. I'm sorry about the delay. My mistake, my bad. Okay. Welcome. My name is Blanca Portillo. I'm very glad to be your help. I'm very glad to be your teacher in this class. So I hope everything goes all right. I hope everything goes well. And it's nice to meet you. Okay. I'm going to start sharing my screen so that you can see what we have for today's class. Okay. Just one second. I want to have this pretty well in order. Yes, definitely. This is my, my slides. One second, please. Here we go. Just to welcome everybody. This is our first class. I hope you're okay. I hope you're fine. I hope you're doing super great. Okay. Let's see who do we have in class today. Our participants. Yes, we have Miss Norma Gonzalez. Can you hear me? Miss Norma Gonzalez. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Fine, and you? I'm fine too. Thank you for asking. It's nice to meet you, Miss Gonzalez. Nice to meet you, Miss. All right, Miss Marta de Acosta. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Great. Nice to meet you, Miss Acosta. Nice to meet you too. Great to meet you. Okay, Mr. William Liborio, welcome. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. All right, Miss Nidia Esmeralda Marroquín, welcome. Welcome, welcome. It is nice to meet you. Hi. Uh, Hi. Great. Nice to meet you too. A pleasure. Yeah, okay. okay, it's the first time actually. Probably you see your new partners. Yes, <laughs> yes, nice to meet you, everyone. Okay, Miss Cecilia de Hernandez, welcome. Thank you, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too. All right, Miss Eva Argueta, welcome. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, thanks. All right, great to hear that, okay? Okay, we also have Miss Jacqueline Campos. How are you, Miss Campos? Uh, hello, uh, I'm very happy. Uh, nice, nice to meet you. Thank nice you. Nice to meet you too, teacher. Glad to meet you, okay. Miss uh, Ana Mayora, or oh, Mayorga. Oh, Mayora. Mayora, wow, that's an interesting name. Welcome. Thank you. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, Miss Marilyn Marcela Martinez. Good evening. Hello, good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. 
Miss Kenya Ayala, welcome. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Okay. I'm fine too, glad to meet you. Okay. All right. Who else? Miss Daisy Carolina Guzman. Hello. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. I'm very glad to meet you. Hi, okay. All right, great. Miss Maritza Isabel Mendez. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Nice. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. All right, Miss Tatiana Barrera. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Okay. Who else? Miss Edith Guzman? Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Glad to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Okay, Miss Jennifer Enrique. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Miss Glenda Martinez, already participated? Hello. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right. It's very nice to be here. It's very nice to meet you all. No sé si alguien se me quedó. Somebody didn't introduce him or herself. Mm -hmm. If we miss a name, can you please say hello? Good evening. How are you? Miss Lorena? Probably. Hi. <laughs> okay. Anybody else? It's the first time you are here. It's the first time you see these new partners. Yes. Mr. Melvin Mejia, probably. Miss Damaris Marroquin. It would be very nice to have all of you with the cameras. It would be very, very nice so that we can see our classmates, okay? We also have Mr. Vidal Mejia. We have Melvin and Vidal Mejia. We have two Mr. Mejia. Uh-huh. And you wanna say nice to meet you? Welcome to this class, okay? All right. It's very nice to have the cameras on. I can see it, okay? So try to have a, a nice space so that you can have the camera, so we can have a contact, we can see each other, so that the class goes easily and goes smoothly, all right? Okay, that's all right. I still see some people are a bit shy. Okay, uh, I'm gonna introduce myself. I'm Blanca Portillo. I work as a teacher. I love teaching English. Well, I have a lot of years of experience teaching. I work with teenagers during the day and I work with adults at this time. Okay, I teach this level of English. I hope, I wish all the best, all the success for this class, okay? So first things first, as I was saying, I like sharing the screen. Okay, upper class. Okay, welcome to everybody. This is our class number one. And we for sure have some objectives. Okay, let me just put this aside a little bit. The objectives for the first class would be to say the month of the year and dates, to say the birthdays from the class and say affirmative and negative sentences using be going to. Okay, introduce yourself. It's time to talk. How can we introduce ourselves? As I say, I'm Blanca Portillo. I'm from San Salvador. I am a teacher of English. I work all day with teenagers. I, I love teaching English. 
I am very glad to be here, okay? Any volunteers? Or we say names, or we say numbers. <laughs> okay, number, number one, Miss Ana Mayora. Tell us about yourself. Okay, my name is Ana Mayora. I live in San Salvador. Um, I work in, uh, in the bank. In a bank? Mm -hmm. All right, nice to meet you. Everybody say nice to meet you. Or everybody shows a reaction with claps, okay? <laughs> yes, Miss Mayora. You prefer Anna or Miss Mayora? Anna. Anna, okay, great. Next, mm -hmm. okay, next is Maritza Isabel Mendez. Hi. Hi. <laughs> My name is. Sorry, sorry. My name is Maritza Isabel Mendez Aguirre. I am a counter. An accountant. Um, uh, yes. Um, I work in Santana City. I am from Chalchuapa. Wow. What do you prefer, Maritza, Miss Mendez? Maritza. Okay, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice right. to meet you. Okay, then we have Cecilia de Hernandez. Hi, my name is, my name is Cecilia Chamilet Araniva de Hernandez. I, I live in San Salvador. Um, I, my job is, sería, uh, assistant, administrative assistant, um, solamente. That's all. <laughs> nice to meet you. Okay, what do you prefer, Maritza or Miss Hernandez? I mean, Cecilia or, 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 yeah, or Miss Hernandez or? Um, Ceci. Ceci, okay, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, then we have Damaris. Hello. Good evening. Yes, se escucha un poquito de interferencia, but it's okay, you can try. Good evening, my name is Damaris Marari Marroquín. I am living in El Salvador. I am a student. Nice to meet you. Okay, what do you prefer, the Maris or Miss Marroquin? Okay, so we're gonna call her the Maris, right? Thank you. Nice to meet you. All right, Miss Stacy, Carolina, introduce yourself. Mm -hmm. My name is Stacy Carolina Osman Campos. Mm -hmm. I am from the city of Berlin in the department of Sultan. Wow. Nice to meet you. I'm glad you're here. Okay. Give me one second. Let's see who else. Who else? Who else? I'm gonna just share the. Okay. Who else? Miss Edith Guzman. Mm 
Hi. Hi. My name is Edith Araceli Guzman. Yes. I am business administration. Uh, I am from Mexicano. Nice to meet you. Nice. Miss Edith Guzman. Okay. We have Eva Argueta or Eva Argueta. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Eva Elsa Argueta de Roque. I am from La Paz. Nice to meet you. Wow, nice we to have meet you too. people from all over the El Salvador. Santa Ana, Sultan, La Paz, San Salvador. That's great. Okay. Miss Glenda Lisette Martinez. Hello, my name Hi. is Glenda Lisette Martinez. Uh, I am from Osicala Morazán. I am a student. I like uh, it. <laughs> nice to meet you. That's great. Uh, I am. No sé, como, ya lo olvidé. I like mountain bike. I you like mountain biking. Uh, drive. No sé, And driving. Uh -huh. uh, driving. Driving. Bike. Oh, riding a bike. Riding a, a bike. Uh -huh. Driving is a car, so riding a bike or riding a motorcycle. Uh -huh. okay. Nice. I am a student um, and friend. An entrepreneur. Emprendedor. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nice. Great to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. All right. Jacqueline Campos. Hello. My name is Jacqueline Campos. I am 40 years old. I am teacher kindergarten. I am living in Santa Tecla and uh, I like um, I like to basketball. You play basketball. I say I would uh, I would leave my family, my son, my father, in, and my mom. That's Thank great. You. That's awesome. Nice to meet you, Miss Campos. Okay, Jennifer. Rodriguez, <laughs> or oh, Jennifer Enriquez, sorry. Yeah, Jennifer Enriquez. Hi, my name is Jennifer. I am from San Salvador. I am a student graphic designer. Wow, that's great, Miss Enriquez. Okay. Then we have Jose, Jose Garcia. Mr. Jose Garcia, are you there? Miss Kenya Ayala. Oh, Jose, he's he's turning on his microphone. Maybe he has some problems with the microphone. So yes, we go with Miss Kenya Ayala. Hi, my name is Kenya Ayala. I'm 40 years old. I'm accountant and living in San Salvador. All right, perfect. Nice to meet you. Miss Lorena Castillo. Hi, teacher. Hi. My name is Lorena Castillo. I live in La Paz. Uh, my name is Quality Outdoor. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, uh, Nice to meet you, teacher and companions. And partners and classmates. Yes. Great. Miss Marilyn, Marcela Martinez. Hello, my name is Marilyn Martinez. I am 22 years old. I live in Oloquilta. I am studying educational center. Wow, nice, nice to meet you. Miss Maritza Mendez.
Yes, the water chef. It's done? Really? Oh, thank you. Really? Okay. But, hi. <laughs> I want My to name is Maritza and Isabel Mendez Aguirre. <laughs> nice. What do you do? You're an accountant? Mm. Yes. All right. I'm a accountant. Okay, you see, I remember. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm checking the list. I am but... from Santana. <laughs> oh, yes, from the list, but the list moves a little bit, probably that's why, okay? But it's okay, you introduce again. Okay, let's see who's missing. Mr. William? Good evening, teacher. Uh, my name is William Liborio. I am 41 years old. Uh, I am lawyer. Uh, uh, I from Aguachapan, but I live in Lourdes, uh, Nice to meet you, everyone. Nice to meet you too, Thank teacher. Thank you. Wow, from Aguachapan to Morazán, we have from all the country. <laughs> That's great. That's really awesome, actually, Mr. Vidal Mejia. Hello, teacher. Hi. Good evening. My name is Vidal Mejia. I am a accountant. I live in Mexic Mexican um, um, San Salvador. Nice. Nice to meet you. Okay. Nice to meet you too. Miss Norma Gonzalez already participated. Hi, good evening. Hi. My name is Norma Gonzalez. I am from San Salvador, but I live in Quesaltepeque. I am auditor. I am an auditor. An auditor. That's great. Miss Nidia Gonzalez. Uh, no, yo, Nidia Marroquín. My name is Nidia Marroquín. Uh, I am 14 years old. I'm from Sonsonate. I live in Sonsonate City. Uh, pues estoy, eh, casa no estoy uh, pero mi de Nice to meet you. I'm sorry, Miss nice Marroquín. Okay. That's great. Okay, who else? We have Mr. Melvin Mejia. Not here. Not today. Okay. Miss. Michelle. Yes. Melvin dice que tiene problemas con su micrófono. Ah, okay. Thank you. Thank you for reporting. Okay. Miss Marta da Costa already participated? Okay, my name is Marta Argueta uh, da Costa. Yes. <laughs> I live in I live in the Mexicanos. Uh, I am an auditor and I have two daughters. Wow, that's great. Nice to meet you. Okay. Who else? Alguien que se nos haya quedado. Somebody that we didn't say a name. Somebody who would like to introduce. Or everybody participated. Yay. <laughs> okay, Miss Tatiana. Tell us. <laughs> Hello, teacher. My Hello. name is Tatiana. I live in Acajutla. I am 25 years old. I like to listen to you. Nice, that's great. I love it. From Acajutla, from Aguachapan, from Mexicanos, from Santa Ana, from many cities. Okay, give me one second. Sorry, I had some interference. I have to fix something here, okay? That's great. Alguien más que se nos haya quedado? Somebody else? Who was not introduced? Or that was it? Okay, we're gonna get to know you better throughout the course, I hope. 
that you learned a lot, that you practice a lot in this course, because that is the idea, okay? To practice, to practice English and to communicate, to ask questions. Whenever you have questions, whenever you want to participate, raise your hand, just go like this. Put your hands up, put your hands up, and then you ask the question, okay? So that's what you have to do. Raise your hand, and then we're gonna let you participate, okay? So that is the idea. I'm just giving examples, okay? All right, do you have any question for me? Any information that you want me to say? Yes? Eh, quizás vuela por mi cuenta, teacher, aunque creo que va para todos. Yes. Venimos eh, en el nivel en el que estamos, venimos de una, ¿cómo diría? Eh, de un proceso, de una etapa en donde quizás la teacher nos hablaba 50 español, 50 en inglés. Entonces, por un lado, qué bien para nosotros, porque tenemos que familiarizarnos eh, con la pronunciación, eh, tenemos que afinar el oído, acostumbrarnos a eso, cosas que no debemos. No sé si tal vez es, plan de, es parte del programa, del proceso que a partir de este nivel nos van a hablar casi solo en inglés y le voy a decir, no, yo personalmente pues le digo, a mí me cuesta el inglés sin embargo trato de hacer el esfuerzo, ¿verdad? Right. Por eso estoy acá, pues, si en algún momento, pues, a mí personalmente me pregunta y no le entiendo me le quedo callado, a lo mejor tal vez sea por eso, y si no yo le entiendo, pues con mucho no gusto problem. yo le voy a responder quizás solamente, teacher, no y problem. bienvenido it's a... ok, it's ok, thank you actually. todos veo caras conocidas Así que, My friends. Eh, bienvenida. Eh, fíjense que quizás no, pero por ahí está un compañero que se llama Vidal. Que a saber qué se me había hecho. Pues, tengo un gusto, Vidal. Welcome back. A todos. Nice es to correcto. Meet you. William, Welcome me da gusto. Back. Y, com y, com y, 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 y comparto la opinión de William Teacher. Sí, Perfect. en efecto, pues no, no, quizás igual no capto al 100%, pero eh, trato. Y, y se nos hacía un poco más fácil quizás el anterior el módulo porque era 50 y 50, pero bueno, vamos a don't hacer worry, lo posible. No te preocupes, es ok. Sí, yes, actually, um, sí, si es necesario hablar un poco de español o hacer algunas aclaraciones, las voy a hacer, no se preocupen. I speak Spanish. Thank okay. you, yes, un, gusto, right. un gusto, William. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice, yes. nice to meet you, William. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Uh, bueno, es parte, sí, es parte del programa. Sí, hay que hacer algunas aclaraciones, algunas explicaciones requieren como para linkear o para hacer una relación más cercana con la con la estructura o con la o con la parte de nuestro idioma natal. Obviamente sí es válido, pero en la medida de lo posible todo lo que ya podamos hay que usarlo, ¿verdad? So that is my advice. That's como mi consejo. That's my piece of advice, okay? Whatever you already know how to say, say it. Say good evening, hello, how are you, my partner? I'm glad to see you. Uh, can you practice? Can you repeat? Porque obviamente si vamos a practicar un montón y vamos a practicar hasta que se nos queden las cosas, obviously, ¿verdad? Así que cualquier cosa, yes, aquí estoy, don't worry. Qué, qué bueno que me lo hacen saber y si es necesario, I'm going to do it. Yes. Pero en la medida de lo posible hay que estar así, ¿verdad? Como bien atentos y tratar de acostumbrar el oído. Y entre más lo hagan, pues más lo van a forzar y más, más rápido lo van a lograr. Which is the idea, ¿ok? La idea es esa, ¿verdad? Ok. Good. I like to have students participation definitely. Definitivamente que me encanta que los estudiantes participen because this class is your class yes so you already introduced yourself that is nice okay so let's continue what else do i have for you today the month and the date ¿Le suena familiar esto? yes no like <laughs> okay do you know the month of and and the dates the month of the year yes alguna vez lo han practicado Oh, this yes, is the first yes, time. Yes, ah, yes, I practice, you say. Yes. yes. Okay, great. Vamos a practicar un poquito. Months. Months. Al final, como una Z. Months. Month of the year. 
And this is very similar to Spanish. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Bye. Algún valiente que quiera decirlos. Somebody. Yo. Okay, yeah. go ahead. Okay, uh, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Wow, claps. Ahí tenemos las reacciones, ¿verdad? Para darle aplauso. Claps, claps, claps. Okay. So nice. That's great. Ajá. ¿Cómo los months of the year? Son bien parecidos, son bien fácil de relacionar porque se parece mucho el sonido a los de español, obviamente. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November. Sobre todo los últimos, ¿verdad? Después de August, September, October, November, December. Si no nos los... No, no estamos como tan confiados de que nos lo sabemos, pues pasémoslo diciendo. O sea, ¿a qué me refiero con esto? En su mente usted puede pasar repitiendo. O sea, no pasa nada. Eso lo único que va a lograr es que su memoria los grabe. ¿ya? Usted puede inventarse un rap, una canción, es decir, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, qué sé yo. ¿ya? So, repeat and repeat. ¿Cómo vamos a usar las fechas de dates? No lo vamos a usar con los números normales que uno conoce, ¿verdad? Los cardinal numbers, sino que lo vamos a usar con los ordinal, porque las fechas denotan un orden. Entonces yo digo, what day is today? You say, and I say, today is February. First, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, ten, twenty fourth. Yes, today is Thursday, February twenty fourth. Yes, actually, ese es el orden en el que vamos a hacer la fecha. Obviamente necesitamos fechas para un montón de cosas, no solo para decir la fecha de hoy, ¿verdad? You have to say, okay, when is your birthday? When is Christmas? When is Mother's Day? Se están preguntando, ¿cuándo? ¿Cuándo? ¿Cuándo es tal cosa, verdad? When do you finish your project? When do you start working? When uh, do we celebrate tal y tal cosa? ¿Cuándo tenemos que presentar un proyecto? So, when. When is Mother's Day, for example? Uh -huh. When is Mother's Day? Mother's Day is May 10th. Oh, May 10th. That's right. Okay. When is Independence Day? Uh -huh. September 15th. September 15th. Exactly. Uh -huh. When is Christmas? December. Uh, 25th? December 24th. We celebrate 25th. exactly the 24th, but the real Christmas is the 25th. Yes, that's great. Uh huh. What else? When is Valentine's Day? February 14th. <laughs> February 14th, exactly. When is Father's Day? Um, June. June 17th. 17th. June 17th. Oh, yes, it's June 17th. Say June 17th. When is Halloween? <laughs> October 21st. October 21st. When is the day of the death? ¿Cuándo celebramos? ¿Cuándo conmemoramos el Día de los Muertos? Like in Coco. 
<laughs> November 2nd. In November 2nd, exactly. When is, let's see, another important celebration? Oh, Children's Day. October 1st. October 1st, exactly. First, second, third. Y de ahí todos los demás, si se fijan, terminan en TH. Yes? First, first. Second, third, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth, twentieth. You can say twentieth or twentieth. Las dos forman están bien, okay? Y luego ya no vamos a decir 20th first, sino que nada más la segunda palabra va a ser modificada. Va a ser 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th. Si ustedes dicen 20 or 20, igual están en lo correcto. ¿okay? Algunas personas dicen 20, otras dicen 20 y las dos son válidas. 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, and the 31st. ¿Por qué no más llegamos aquí hasta el 31st? No porque los números ordinales lleguen hasta ahí, son hasta el infinito. Pero la fecha, los días del mes, solo son hasta ahí. ¿Ya? ¿Any question? ¿Hay alguna duda sobre esto? ¿No? No. No, perfect. Va, ya lo practicaron también en la plataforma. Of course, teacher. Yes. Of course. Did you practice? Yes. Okay. Bye. Let's continue. Ajá. Aquí tengo algunas imágenes que les pueden servir. Yo se las voy a compartir para que practiquemos. Y obviamente... Estas imágenes de los Month of the Year, si se fijan, representan alguna holiday, alguna celebración. Entonces ustedes van a preguntar, las que se sepan, no todas creo que se las sepan. Ok, por ejemplo, November, esto creo que podría tener que ver con lo de uh, Thanksgiving, que es una celebración gringa. So, October es Halloween, September. No sé si aquí tiene que ver algo con otra cosa, pero nosotros sabemos que tenemos una important celebration on September, which is Independence Depends. Day. Ajá. En August, ¿qué es lo que generalmente tenemos en August? Es super important. Y todos esperamos. Vacation. 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 <laughs> vacation. And when is August vacation? Toda la first week, then. From the 1st of August to the 6th of August. Pero el día oficial de la celebration is the 6th of August. Right? So, it's okay if you want to say the 6th of August or August 6th. Las dos formas están correctas también. Okay? So, no problem. Bye. Vamos a crear breakout rooms. Vamos a crear rooms para trabajar. Y ustedes luego van a preguntar. ¿Qué preguntas pueden hacer? When is Christmas? When is your birthday? When is Mother's Day? When is Valentine's Day? Miss Castillo has a question. Dígame. Tell me. Yes. Miss Lorena, ¿tiene alguna duda, alguna pregunta? O accidentally se levantó la mano. <laughs> Bye, vamos a crear, let me see, six rooms. Van a quedar como en grupos de tres y ustedes van a hacer todas las questions que quieran hacer para practicar las fechas. O si no, pueden escuchar a su partner decir, dígame los months of the year. O dígame, eh, what is the first month of the year? What is the sixth month of the year? What is the seventh month of the year? For example, si yo le pregunto, what is the fourth month of the year? ¿Ustedes cómo me responderían? April. April. April, yes. The fourth month of the year is April. What is the sixth month of the year? June. 
June, exactly. Yes. The six months six of the year is June. June, exactly. Entonces, todo ese tipo de questions en las que puedan involucrar fechas, meses, van a hacerla. Yo no les voy a dar una guía porque algunos tienen otras más creativas, ¿verdad? Entonces, solamente voy a enviar las imágenes para que tengan el vocabulary al grupo de WhatsApp. ¿Es that okay? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No lo movió a ninguna sala, mister. My birthday. No, the the Mother's Day. Oh, the Mother's Day is um ten uh ten May the ten the May. Yes. When is your birthday? Hola, no la escuché yo. What is the but it's the first months and the years. Okay. Uh, January. Yes. Pregunto a Jennifer. When is your birthday? It's 22nd. I tendría que contestar is el mes y luego el, el día. May. It's June 22nd. Ok. Ok. Thank you. May. May. Mayo, mayo, como yo, como May, May, como se llama May, 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 ok. May, 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 en January, January, celebramos el año nuevo con el primero de enero, sí, yo creo, según la imagen que mandó, New year. Happy New Year. Yes. New year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Es correcto. Yes, that's correct. In March. Um, March. March. Um, 
No idea. Um, aquí, aquí no tenemos, no sé qué quiero Sometimes, decir. sí, algunas veces Semana Santa cae en March y otras veces en April. Entonces podríamos decir yeah. sometimes. Sometimes, sometimes, podríamos decir vacation. Yes, sometimes it's Easter vacation in March. Sometimes okay. Easter vacation is in April. Uh -huh. ¿Y si That... quiere decir Semana Santa? Holy Week. Holy Week. Holy, Holy, Holy Week. Holy Week. Es Semana Santa. Holy es Santo. Week. Semana vacation Santa. Holy yeah. Week is correct. Yes, you can say we have a Holy Week vacation. Holy week. In this, mm -hmm. in this, this year is going to be in April, right? In April. Uh -huh. Porque ni siquiera hemos celebrado Ash Wednesday. This year. Uh -huh. No yet, ¿verdad? No ha sido yes. todavía. No. No yet. To, uh, March 2. March 2nd is going to be Ash March Wednesday. March 2nd. March, ah. March 2nd. That's right. And, Next. and Holy Week. Uh -huh. um, April. April 10th. April 10th. Yes. All right. Thank you for the information. I didn't know. <laughs> okay, That's important. Thank you. Yes. On my beard, I do. <laughs> Did you finish? Did you practice? Ya se escucharon a todos. Se pueden decir los months. Se pueden decir las fechas, las celebrations. Ajá. Uh -huh. Did you practice? Yes, teacher. Ok. Yes, nadie, teacher. No, nadie necesita ayuda. Nobody needs to practice more. It's ok. No. All right. Perfect. It's ok. It's okay. This meeting is being recorded. Hey, welcome back. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Okay, did you practice? What are the possible questions that you practiced? Mm -hmm. Any question that you ask? Cualquier pregunta que hayan hecho. Díganme. Mm -hmm. When is your okay. birthday? When is your birthday? Uh -huh. Miss Campos? Esa iba a decir, when is your birthday? Uh, <laughs> the common when, questions. Uh, what is your mom prefer? What is your favorite month? What month do you prefer? Yes, todos tenemos un favorite month. ¿Cuál es el de ustedes? ¿Sí? Todos van a decir December. Yeah, December. <laughs> April. April. Yeah. Because it's your birthday. Yeah. February. 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 I love you. I, I love, love you. February. Yeah. <laughs> I love Valentine's. I'm in love. <laughs> okay. Yes, February is pretty. It's very pretty. But mm -hmm. yes, December. It's unique. <laughs> yes, Miss Hernandez. Uh, when is when is, when is summer vacation in in El Salvador? When is summer vacation in El Salvador this year? Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's going to be in April. Somebody says it's going to be in April. Uh -huh. We also have another vacation in August, right? <laughs> Repeat. <laughs> okay. Any other possible question? No. When do we celebrate? When do we celebrate Mother's Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? When is Independence Day in El Salvador? Yes. All those are possible questions. Okay. 
let's practice let's practice 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 the month okay but let's also practice the dates first second third fourth fifth until you remember no se les puede olvidar okay? no podemos decir uh, march 1 no that's not possible it has to be march 1st march 2nd march 3rd march 4th yes and so on and so on yes Okay, when is the last day of February? ¿Cuál es el último día de este mes? What is the last day of February? 28. 28. 28. 28. Exactly. 28. What happened? Why February only has 28 day? ¿Por qué el 28 es el último día de February? ¿Hay alguna razón que yo no sepa? <laughs> I don't know, teacher. It's a it's short month. Uh, it's a short. It's the it's, it's um, short um, day. It's the month days. short. It's a month. It's a it's a very short month. Yes, it only has twenty eight days. I don't know why. Y cada cuantos años it has twenty nine. Four. 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 Every four, four. Years. Every yeah. four years. Every four years. And why? Why every four years? Ah, <laughs> investigate. Teacher. Teacher. Yes. 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 Ah, hay como que agregar un poquito más de tiempo, ¿verdad? Para que se complete la rotación. Ajá, Mr. Liborio, es the same theory. No, no. Eh, casi parecido a lo que dice la compañera. Tengo entendido eh, de que la rotación de la Tierra dura 365 días. Exactly. Razón por la cual eh, febrero, no sé por qué razón le pusieron de 28 días, pero eh, por la cantidad de días que lleva la rotación, es por eso, por los 365 días. Y se vuelve bisiesto cada cuatro años porque como que ahí nivelan lo que es la rotación. Al tener 365 días, como que eh, no sé si la tierra o el tiempo se va trazando. Entonces, con ese día que se aumenta, eh, llega, digamos, como al nivel eh, el, del uso horario. Exacto. Al menos lo que yo tengo entendido. Por ahí va, por ahí va la, la razón. Right. Ok, y esto es que nosotros eso nada más, digamos, detallito, ¿verdad? pero por ejemplo en los países nórdicos, en los países que están como más cerca de los polos, cada estación, cada vez que hay un cambio de estación de otoño, invierno, invierno, verano, qué sé yo, adelantan o atrasan una hora, aún más, o sea, es like more difficult. So, for example, yo estuve en the States y hubo el cambio como de... Pero cambiaban from winter to spring, creo. Y sí, agregaron, o sea, es como que adelantaron una hora. Entonces, era, nos teníamos que levantar más temprano. Ya eran six. Y I was like, ah, oh, man, you have to adapt, ¿ok? So, ahí todavía hay otros cambios, ¿verdad? Bueno, pero esas son situaciones ya científicas. El punto es, today we have to practice the month and the date, ¿ok? Tomorrow we're going to practice going to. Tenemos que ir ahí practicando conforme vamos desarrollando la plataforma. Tomar de repente apuntes de algo, unas cosas que ustedes quieren que, que, bueno, que refresquemos o que no les quede tan claro. Y ustedes pueden decir, ah, esto le voy a preguntar a la teacher, why this, o why this, o por qué esto, o por qué aquello, ¿verdad? O algo que no les fue tan fácil resolverlo y tú de alguna duda, pues lo podemos aclarar en clase. ¿Okay? La teacher. Yes. Generalmente las clases son de lunes a jueves. Vamos yes. a tener mañana. Yes, es, ajá, es algo que también les iba a recalcar, que es para compensar eh, un número de horas. Entonces, tomorrow there is class. Pero solo por esta semana. Just this week. Ok, gracias. Okay. Uh -huh. Anything else? Thank you, Chair. Bye. 
Good night. Enjoy. Okay, bye. See you Good tomorrow. Night. I see you see tomorrow. You tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. bye. Blessing. Good night. God bless you. God bless you too.